They're the most famous catchphrases that captured the world's attention and made Australia the place to be. Tonight we look back on 50 years of campaigns that have shaped our global image and sparked an international influx down under. It's how Australia was introduced to the world. G'day. 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 G'day, love. A warm welcome. We've saved you a spot on the beach. And lessons in the Australian way of life. There's a fella working flat out on his Aussie holiday. Keep up the good work, mate. It all started in 1967. Our first tourism ads showed off our natural attractions, friendly wildlife, famous faces, even our cheeky side. Could I borrow that paper when you finish, love? Yeah, sure, no problem. That Aussie sense of humour that made the world smile. Every Australian has their favourite campaign, the campaign that they don't like. Uh, what I'm excited to celebrate is 50 years of the tourism industry in this country going from strength to strength. From when Lara Bingle famously asked, So where the bloody hell are you? To the latest campaign with Chris Hemsworth. It's a place you feel. And a place where enticing tourists has been a piece of cake. Best country in the world and I've been many places. When the first ads launched in 67, we're attracting 222,000 international tourists a year who are spending 74 million. These days, more than 8 million people head down under and now they spend more than $40 billion. In Paul Hogan's words... No wonder they call this the lucky country. Amanda Abate, 7 News.